Hey guys, this is Sean Aralu. How's everybody doing today? On the last episode, we came across out here in Route 3, I do believe? But after, before that, we also, uh, uh, also went to, um, the Dream Yard and found out that the other sage is over there. Then we came across, uh, to the right, uh, no, to the left side that uh we came across where we found uh our woo bath so in other words that we are here into this so i had a little excuse you i had a little trouble by actually recording all this and apparently i thought that my phone might accidentally delete this game and i was like thinking oh shit am i gonna be able to like replace a new one that would not be good don't do it but it looks like everything is just doing just fine. So we are here. And I want to go up here. Now you remember this woman who actually traded with you? Well, guess what? Her cottony has actually grown up a bit. As my Pokemon. So in other words, it is now Wismacot. I gotta say guys, I think Wismacot is kind of cute looking Pokemon. I'm not kidding. I mean, look at its happy face. Yeah, I think it's adorable. And I wonder how it feels like. Either, like, fluffy? Like, I think it might be fluffy. Yeah, let me take a sip really quick, so... I'm really thirsty here. Yeah. So, yep. You can battle her anytime that you want, so in other words, you can always battle her whenever you want. Um, there's also one more thing I want to do, because guess what? There is something I want to do really quickly, because there is a Pokemon that I've been telling you guys that I forgot to actually do it since, um, since we- n Stop it! F fucking buttons! That I forgot to actually do a long time ago. So, I'm going to go into the museum where the gym is. And I'm also going to resurrect the plume fossil that we have in our, um, in our bag. And since I never got the chance to actually do that in a long time. So, I thought we could actually resurrect the plume fossil. Into... Arkin! It is not Archin, it is Arkin. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, it's pro it's it's pronounced Arkin. You don't believe me? You can always look up on uh, Pokemon Preancinate. Pre I can't even say the name. <laughs> just find, just um, just look up on an app that you uh, can have on your phone that is actually uh, for Pokemon, and uh, it's actually like an audio Pokedex. And it will actually uh, talk to you for what Pokemon it is, and what it can do, and um, also how to say its name. So in other words, be more smart than the freaking phone, Pokedex, whatever the hell it's called. So now, since we are here, I like to... There is an item up here, so... Uh, once when I try to record this game, apparently... It didn't want to agree with me, and since it decided to say, Oh, I'm sorry, you will not be recording this. Your storage has been filled. And I'm like, are you kidding me? I was not very happy about that, actually. But I'm hoping that it'll actually do it again. I'm hoping it doesn't do that again, I meant to say. But, um, yeah, it just really, 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 really sucks about this. So, in other words... We are here into, uh, this. I'm going to use another repel. So, this is where we actually got ourselves the Pokemon called Sock. And I'm really, really proud of him of going that far in order to, uh, complete the whole trials of the, uh, Pokemon League. Problem is, we are still not the champion just yet. So, in other words, that once more we're done the whole thing... We'll go back to the Pokemon League, and then we will, uh, challenge the Elite Four again. again. Uh, the only problem is that the way I look at the Elite Four when I was looking up online, actually, when I first played the game, 
And it was not a very pretty sight, because I end up losing every single fucking time. And, boy, th those, those fucking trainers are actually really tough. And sometimes it's really hard for me to beat them all, especially when you get to the champion altar. Oh, boy. I am not looking forward to that. So, in other words, uh, play smart. Be really, really smart of only, um using your Pokemon in order to, like, um, get stuff done. In other words, reach up to the highest level as best you can, and then defeat the Elite Four. Because I'm telling you guys, these people are not easy to beat. Okay, another Repel wore off. So I still have an egg with me, which I could probably do it off-screen, try to hatch it. But I'm not gonna, like, um, try to, like, force hatch it just yet until I'm done recording. So, in other words, yeah. Um, I tried doing that one time, too, and apparently it decided to cut me off after I hatched the Pokemon. And then it decided to say, oh, I'm sorry, you will not be hatching this Pokemon until the recording is actually, like, fucked me over. And it happened not just once, but twice when I tried to hatch the Pokemon when I, uh, paused the game. And so far, it just really sucks about what's going on. So in other words, yeah, I don't like the way that this recording stuff do that to me. But I was still afraid that the Pokemon game would actually, uh, like the Pokemon game that I have here, will not be here anymore. Because uh, once when I tried, once when I was about to record this game and it decided to uh, be deleted, and I'm like, wait, what? No! No, I don't want to start all over again. And I was like afraid of my life because I thought it was going to be start over again. I'm like, no, 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 please don't, please don't. So I had to like uh, find out if I can get the Pokemon game back. And uh, luckily I got it back just in time before anything else happens. Holy shit. Like I was uh, extremely scared. Like I was extremely scared. Uh, but luckily I got the game back, so no need to worry. Thank God. <laughs> so, I want to apologize to you that I haven't been playing the game in a while, because I've been actually really busy and also hanging out with my boyfriend. So, uh, we spent time together and we were having so much fun. And um, after last night, my boyfriend, my dad, and I, we were downstairs at my house uh, watching a movie which happened so-called to be, um, oh god, what was it called again? Uh, Aquaman, and, um, I gotta be honest, I don't really like, um, Breakdown and Route 13, nice. Um, I don't really like the, um, DC, uh, movies, because there is some DC movies that are actually a little bit dark, and the way it's dark like that, I was extremely afraid of my life. So guess what? I'm actually going to try to hatch the egg right now while I'm actually talking. So in other words, yeah. So anyways, I've been actually trying to like get over about the fear that is happening about Pokemon, not Pokemon, sorry, DC Comics, because I am not a fan of DC, but I do love Marvel movies. I don't know why, but um, there are only two movies about DC I really like. And that would be Wonder Woman and now uh, Aquaman. It's a new movie that you guys never seen before. It's already out on DVD, so I think you guys are going to love it. It's pretty funny, and somehow the critics didn't even like it at all, because they say they only give it two stars. And that actually sucks, on my opinion. Especially for my mom and dad, because they were like, what do you guys know about it? You're just too dense. And there are some movies that they really, really like, especially some old ones, that the critics didn't even like either. Apparently, they actually give it, like, maybe a half a star, two stars, three stars, maybe one star. And Mom and Dad had a fancy fit. <laughs> Which really sucks because they wanted uh, the movie to be the best, and... Since they saw the whole thing, and they're like, oh, the critics don't even know what they're talking about. I'm like, mom, dad, it's the critics. They don't give a shit what you people think. And that's actually true, because I had some movies I really loved when I was a little girl. 
And apparently they only give it like a half a star. And I was so pissed off because I was like, are you kidding me? I know that movie. You, you only give it like a half a star. Are you serious? What kind of a fuck up people are you? Well, apparently, I didn't want to say that in front of those uh, people. Like, in front of them. I mean, like, um, in face to face. Because as much as I want to say in front of their faces, I would probably get arrested by that. No one wants to get arrested. But anyways, um, I'm just hatching, like, my egg because I wanted to hatch the egg about this video in a long time. And since I tried to record this and it cut me off, like, twice, I hope it doesn't do that again, like, three times. Because I wanted to actually try to, um, try to hatch this Pokemon egg. Since I have it with me and I wanted to hatch and then put it back in the PC so I can actually continue on this. Uh, but so far, uh, hatching Pokemon eggs are not really easy. If you have a, if you have Pokemon that has flame body or magma armor in order to hatch the Pokemon, then you can actually be happy to hatch those things. But unfortunately, I don't have any of those Pokemon that has either uh, flame body or magma armor. And there are many, many fire type Pokemon. Well, not many of them, but uh, some of the Pokemon that I don't even know if they have any, even have the ability. And it's really rare and sight to see, so I'm hoping to actually get the Pokemon I wanted to hatch this on video. But I'm just hoping that it doesn't actually cut me off, so I'm just going to continue this on. And hopefully I can actually hatch the egg. Uh, what else I could actually talk to you guys about? Um, there is a thing that my parents and my sister have told me when Sissy was a little girl, and... My, uh, father's gra uh, my father's mother, na uh, we call her Nanny Granny, and when my sister told me that when she was a little girl and she was playing hide and seek with my Nanny Granny, how many of you people ever played hide and seek with your grandparents? Like, seriously. No, 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 no. Sorry about that. Okay, anyway. So, um, uh, so my mother, my, my sister was playing hide and seek, and so far, um, what she did, it was so funny as hell, what she did is actually scare my poor grandmother, is actually hiding underneath a blanket on the floor. And while that happened, my nanny granny is finding my sister. Sissy fell asleep on the floor with a blanket over her head. Well, actually over her body. But, um, my grandmother could not find her anywhere. And she's been looking for her ever since. And she's been like, Okay, this is not good. So, she called my dad uh, from work and says, I lost your daughter. I can't find her anywhere. We were playing hide and seek. And dad's like, uh, All right. Hold on a second. It's finally hatching. Hatch the egg! Larvesta! No, I don't want to give it a name. Anyway, continuing on. Um, apparently, my dad's like, call the sheriff. So, my nanny granny called sheriffs, and they brought in two sheriffs in complete uniforms. I'm not kidding. Those uniforms were terrifying, and once when my sister actually got into involved with this, she scared my poor nanny granny about this, and that's when... Um, they try to find her, and then they actually found her. Once when they did that, they brought her down, and my sister was petrified. I mean, I'm not kidding. She was petrified. So, in other words, um, yeah, it was really scary for her poor sissy. So, she does not want to play hide-and-seek ever again with my, with my nanny granny. It was hilarious. It was funny. And I... Oh, there's the body now. <laughs> and, um... Yeah, Sissy does not want to handle this ever again. Like, ever again. So now we got the Pokemon Egg Hatch. I want to do something very, very special. So there may be some of you actually been doing a lot of uh, things, right? Well, apparently there is one thing I want to do really quickly. And that's by going to... I wonder if it's this one? Yeah, it's this one. 
Okay, I want to go to here. And I want to get on board. So there is a possibility that you can do, do two things. Either one, you can actually uh, battle a lot of trainers that they have here in here. And um, there uh, today is actually four. Uh, so in other words, it's four trainers that you can actually probably battle. But there is something I want to do really, really, really good. Because I don't think any of you guys I ever seen that actually done this before or stay like that for a, for a while. And that's by going up here. Now watching this is so beautiful. If you see on the uh, right screen, this is where the boat is actually taking you uh, underneath the bridge in any way. So this is actually my favorite part of this of the game because you get to see everything. And I just love this. Like, look at this. Look at this. This is just amazing. Just look it up in the sky and you see the bridge with the lights. Oh my god, my heart is like pounding with beautiful like this. And every time I'm watching this, it just makes me want to go on a cruise myself. I've never been on a cruise and I don't think I can. It's expensive as hell. But I don't know if you guys ever like done this before. And there's the other bridge, which is on the other side, I think. So anyway, um... So, this is like just an amazing thing, and I don't know if you, any of you ever done this before, but I have. And sometimes I do love to actually battle with trainers inside the uh, inside the boat. But I want to do this on screen. Like, I want to show you guys what it feels like to go on an adventure inside a fucking ship. And once when you turn around, it goes dark. And once when you go back to the other side of the bridge to the city, it's amazing. Like, it's springtime, and it's just beautiful. Like, it's just the beautiful thing I've ever seen in my, in, in my entire life. And if you just listen to the music, it's breathtaking. So I'm just going to be really quiet from now on. Uh, that was breathtaking, and I'm sorry about the lock screen thing, if you guys ever saw that. Um, anyways, yeah, uh, this is like my favorite part of all time, and if you want to battle these trainers, you can do it like every evening once a day. So in other words, you can actually be happy to do that. I don't think there's very much things I can actually do in this part of the city, so in other words, I'm going to ride my bike, and I'm going to go all the way down. Uh, excuse me. So in other words, I want to go all the way down here. And... Uh, so much things we have to do, but not today. So in the meantime, we are here in Route 4. Okay, guys, so in the meantime, please make a like down below and also subscribe. And if you want to comment to me, please feel free. So I hope you guys have a wonderful, beautiful day. It's going to be night soon, so in other words, have a wonderful night. Bye!